You knew! You knew I would like this! Welcome back to the channel. I'm Justin Burke. I'm a singer, songwriter, and vocal coach. And I have to tell you, before we get into it real quick, that if you would like to learn how to sing, do not give up on that dream. Don't give up on your dream of singing because I am telling you right now, you absolutely can learn. You can have an amazing voice. You can have an amazing voice. No matter what level you are starting at, why am I qualified to tell you that? Well, because I used to not be able to sing at all to save my life. If you wanna hear more about my story, I have like a video on my homepage of my YouTube channel that you can check out and you can hear how bad my voice used to sound. Maybe don't do it, okay? Yeah, you know what, on second thought, it's okay if you don't. If this naturally untalented guy can do it, you absolutely can. You might have heard me talk about this a lot, but I made a free singing lesson for you. I would love it if you would take it after this reaction. It's 15 minutes, it's a video. I'm basically gonna be like guiding you. We got this cool blue background going on too, and I'm like making you guys bounce around and do all this crazy exercises, but when you are done with that 15 minutes, you are going to hear an improvement in your voice. And I just know it's going to get you excited. I know it's going to get you motivated. And um, that's what I want for you. I want you to realize that you can learn how to sing. And so when you're ready, you know where to go. The link is down below. Okay, let's get into it. You all have requested this for quite some time. I've been sleeping on this song, so here we go. It's my first time hearing it. <laughs> You knew I would like this. Oh, I like that octave. What the hook? like this this is not have voice so piercing but also breathy beautiful tone it's hard to get a good tone up there you know I tell you that a lot it is it's impressive Come on, V. Come on, V. Come on, V. V's my favorite right now. I go back and forth with... The Heartbreaker. V, the Heartbreaker. Ooh, I like how they stopped the bass on that. Jimin and Jungkook, their mixed voices have gotten so good. They've improved a lot at their mixed voice. Listen up. Dang, you hear that riff up there? And 
what a song. Great songwriting, like chef, like for the fans. What a beautiful song. And listen to that chant back. Imagine live. See, they wrote it with this chant at the end so that the crowds at the end, everybody's going to be chanting that. Wow. Rarely does an artist make a song truly for the fans like that. Wow. That's cool. And then Jungkook with that breathy tone on the end. And you know he probably recorded that sitting down. He probably recorded that sitting down on his chins like he did before. He probably recorded that upside down. All right, he's probably over there in the studio like... You know, sing. Oh, okay, I'm gonna break this. I'll stop before I break this. You know, I always have to keep it real with you all. EDM at this point with those big crazy drops, I'm kind of over it. All right, I feel like that's been overdone for most songs. I think for me, also because I'm a producer, I know exactly what's gonna happen. I know the pre chorus is coming in, the drums, the snare is about to go double time, and then all of a sudden you're gonna pause for a measure, and then you're gonna have this big drop with the crazy sense, you know, with the saw sense in the back. I used to produce EDM, and so that's why I think I'm just like, okay, I know exactly how this is going to sound. For most songs, for most songs. But this song, I actually really, really liked it. They put their own little twists on it in the hook that they added to that drop sounded really good. The way that they all layered the vocals, the way that they sang in that beautiful kind of head voice falsetto at times, and then when they took it up, it sounded great. Like again, the way that they overlaid, overlaid the voices, it didn't just sound like a future pop kind of synth style song. It didn't sound like all the rest. It can be hard to make those kinds of songs different because they just, the, the way that the beats are made, they just pretty much all sound the same. Anyway, I give them tons of props. Not only do they sound great on the song, but they also turned an instrumentation that could have just been pretty generic into a masterpiece because of the vocals. And that's why the vocals are so important. The little overlays, the little like background ooze that they would add. And I'll have to listen again in headphones to really hear everything. But the ad libs that they would add, all of those things are what makes the song and it's what makes it, you know, unique. And especially in that kind of genre that that song was, was that kind of genre. That's a tough genre to make anything unique in. And that shows just how important vocals are. Vocals can make or break a song. Vocals can completely even change a song and it can take a generic beat and turn it into a masterpiece. So I give the guys tons of props for doing that. Leave me a comment. What do you think? Do you agree? Do you disagree? I'd love to hear. Leave it in the comments down below. If you are new to our channel family, make sure to hit the subscribe button. It is right there. If you would like to learn to sing, you know where to go. Check out Singer. It's in the description. Take that free 15 minute singing lesson. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, you are going to love it, but it's mainly you're going to love it because it's going to make you realize what you're capable of because I'll be guiding you through the exercises, but it's not me who's doing it. It's not me who's transforming your voice. It's you. You are going to be the one doing it. And so I can't wait for you to show yourself what you're capable of. And I really think that that 15 minute lesson is going to lay something out for you to be able to have that realization. And I want that for you. So. Yeah, I'd love it if you go take that like right now. The link is just right down in the description. You can get access to it instantly. It's a video just like this. Um, but if not, whenever you have 15 minutes, go take that. Again, it's on Singer. It's on my site. Link is in the description. All right, tons of love. And I will see you in the next video. <laughs> Peace. Hello. If you give me a few minutes, I'm going to prove to you that you can have the singing voice that you've dreamed of. I couldn't sing to save my life. I'm going to play you a little clip of one of my first recorded songs and uh, try not to cringe. Roll the clip. Yeah, I know. There is hope. Because now I am a professional singer. I've toured around the nation performing my original music. Hey, it's the way. Hey, yeah. I've performed for thousands live and millions online. The only reason I'm saying that is to say that if this naturally untalented guy can do it, you absolutely can. But don't just take my word for it. 
We get many testimonials coming in every day from people who are using Singer and getting incredible results. And I 100% would recommend Singer TV. Like, I was skeptical, I'm like, is this thing actually gonna work? But I remember five minutes into that video, like, I was singing better than I've ever sang in my life. Singer is where you need to be. It has perfected my singing. I really recommend you to your singer. Go ahead and take the free lesson below as well to just get started. It's a 15 minute sample lesson. The reason Singer works so well is because it takes all of the best techniques and exercises that I've personally accumulated over my 10 year singing journey. You're gonna learn things like how to hit high notes with ease, how to know the hardest riffs and runs, how to sing with vibrato dynamics. I'll see you inside Singer, tons of love, and I'll talk to you soon. Peace.